All right. Finally, a quick story about uh, Jordan Peterson. So Jordan Peterson, if you remember, we covered this on the show a few months ago. God, I'm, I'm, I'm having to speed through these. We covered this a few months ago on the show. Jordan Peterson, uh, there was a complaint to the College of Psychologists of Ontario in 2022 uh, about uh, things that Jordan Peterson said that, that people found offensive. Oh, my God. They, they, they found them offensive and, and unsensitive, and um, they complained to the College of Psychologists of Ontario. The College of Psychologists of Ontario told Peterson that he had to undergo sensitivity training, that he had to, uh, and if not, and if he did not go through sensitivity training, he would be kicked out of the College of Psychologists, in a sense, lose his license to practice psychology in Canada, which is just unbelievable and horrific um, to do. Now, I would have no problem with that if the College of Psychologists was truly a private college, right, a private licensing organization, and, uh, but, and there was competition, and you could be licensed by somebody else, and you could still study, uh, practice psychology, but you can't. They have a monopoly, a government-granted monopoly over the issuance of licenses for the practice of psychology. So they control the market. So if you lose the ability to practice psychology from the College of Psychologists, you lose your ability to practice psychology in Canada. And therefore, Jordan Peterson w- was going to lose his, his license, which is just such a violation of, of, of free speech and so horrific. Anyway, Jordan Peterson sued. And it went to a, uh, a div- what's called a divisional, uh, a divisional court in um, uh, in Canada, and the court ruled for the College of Psychologists yesterday. Um, and and the court says uh, the court says uh, this in uh, uh, in response to his lawsuit. Quote: The order is not disciplinary, and does not prevent Dr. Peterson from expressing himself on controversial topics. It has a minimal impact on his right to freedom of expression. That he has to go and do sensitivity training here. He can, he can express himself on controversial topics as long as he does it sensitively. He just does it nicely. He just does it by the speech code dictated by the College of Psychologists. So, um, no, there is, this is just one example or the fact that Canada is, is much worse than America in this sense. There really isn't free speech in, 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 in Canada. Uh, and the court has just backed this up. It's a horrible ruling. I, 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 feel, I, I feel bad. I, you know, I'm not a fan of Jordan Peterson's, but I feel bad for Jordan Peterson. Um, it basically, I don't think he's going to allow himself to go through sensitivity training. Basically means he can't practice psychology in, in, in Canada. Now maybe he can do something else. Maybe there's another form of appeal. But this is bad. This is horrific. This is a really, really bad state of affairs. And um, yeah, I mean, just, just, just terrible, right? Just terrible.